to Glasgow for the first time, you know, and seeing this spectacular building on the top of the hill, and then realising that you're part of this tradition of 500 plus years was a, a big, a big thing, really. I think it's kind of amazing when you think about it because the people that went through and did this degree 50 years ago are the reason that we're able to do it. It was a great time to uh, just to find yourself, to you know, make friends and, and use that platform um, as you went further in your, uh, in your career and in your professional lives. I walked in to meet my group for the first time for our, one of our first assignments and you just sit down and it was just the easiest experience. You just were automatically included because they've seen you in lectures because you are such a close-knit group. It's interesting, at the time I probably thought the beer was a great training, but as a stepping stone to something. Now I see it as a really, really good foundation. They are formative years when you're at university. I'd moved away from home for the first time, so I was in halls of residence, which is a completely different form of education, of course. I think university as an experience as a whole um, shapes who you are as a person. You learn um, so much there about um, skills that transfer into the workplace and beyond. I become more confident, um, I become a lot more motivated as well. I know exactly where I want to go and I think a lot of that has been built upon from the, the strong foundations that I've had throughout my, my time doing the BIAC degree at Glasgow. It's been great, it's been challenging, um, there's been times when it's been, it's been tough but um, I don't feel you're ever out your depth, you get a lot of support. We got on so well with the tutors and the lecturers and it was a kind of a working relationship. I think the most valuable lesson is probably that our students are our biggest assets. Um, as accountants we know about assets. Without the support that they've given me, um, I wouldn't have had such a positive experience throughout the four years that I've had here. I think they taught us how to respect one another and to respect different opinions. Do you remember some of the, um, some of the accounting society bashes? Probably not as well as you do. <laughs> In fact, what happened to that moustache? <laughs> Lots of us, you know, 18 away from home the first time, discovering new experiences. I acquired a great taste for tin and its lager. And uh, I used to indulge that, that, that uh, taste fully um, after every exam. And we had a lot of exams in the BIAC. So I'm quite an aficionado when it comes to tin and its lager. <laughs> We've had some romances. <laughs> We've had some marriages. <laughs> so that's always nice too. We had a very memorable party. I think it might be a punch party. I remember the bacchanalian chaos that was thereafter, but boy, did we have fun. So that's maybe not what I meant to say at this point in the interview. <laughs> boy, did we have fun. It was great, it was great fun. My most memorable experience of the, um, of the BIAC was, uh, was probably uh, you know, getting to the end of the degree and uh, having survived three years of intense study and, uh, and coming out with the, uh, with the graduate uh, qualification. I think graduation was very memorable, yeah, because it epitomised the effort and hard work over the past four years. BIAC, it is challenging, but it's going to change you and make you a better person. As you kind of progress through your years, it was something that I was always very proud of. It's been a great four years, it's been a really quick four years, and I know I'm going to be proud of the fact that I've done this degree. I really, I really enjoyed my three years uh, as a BIAC, I, I, I really value the friendships that I made. To say that you studied at University of Glasgow is, is worth its weight in gold. But above all, it was just fun. I thoroughly enjoyed it. Great fun. <laughs>